Good evening and welcome to Matt Becker Video. Tonight's episode could be about anything. Thursday, January 5th, 1.20 p.m. 33... Ooh, is that a puppy? <sighs> I keep forgetting it's winter. So a spam bot commented on one of my posts with a link to some website about what, who knows what, but at the end of their spam was a poem. The wood rectifies the bright animal. How does the prose capture the noxious debt? When does the rule terminate the full song? And if you search for that poem, you can find many other spam bots that have put that at the end of their message. Look at this. Is that a tiny little rocking horse? <clears throat> Pokeball. There's like a big duck party going on right now. Lots of mallards, but I can see some hybrids in there. Like this guy. Oh, they're coming this way. Uh-oh. See, they think I have food, but I don't. So they're going to be disappointed. Yeah, you shouldn't give ducks and geese white bread because it uh, causes them to become malnourished. And the tips of their wings start to curl. It's called angel wing. And then they can't fly anymore, and then basically they're sitting ducks. Deer track right there. Looks like a hoof. Huh. Air dancers were invented in 1996 for the Summer Olympics. So I guess in the same sense that everything is music, everything is also art. kind of a big seagull. You know, I'm still thinking about this whole goals thing because probably like everyone out there, I'm wondering what the heck am I supposed to be doing with my time? I guess for me it's hard to know how I'm supposed to get ahead or what that even means to get ahead. Like it's the goal that I should be exerting more energy. Am I supposed to be making more money so I can afford more things and then my life becomes about sustaining those things with the money I make? Am I supposed to have a job where I just spend all my time doing the job and not having free time to do anything else? I'd rather just try and fulfill my girlfriend's dreams. She has much more of a vision, and so it just makes sense to me that any extra energy I have, I would just devote to allowing her to fulfill her dreams. I don't think it makes sense to try and spend your life waiting for something to happen to you. But I also believe that anything that's worth doing you go for it on your own. Look at this. An animal cord my gourd. Now, what kind of animal could live in this hole? Well, if it were really living inside, I think a small bird, this could easily be converted into a birdhouse. Raccoon is a always a possibility, but I know... I know, I know there's a possum that lives around here, so that'd be pretty cool if it, a little possum got in. I would like that. <laughs> 